Hey, what's going on, everybody? Uh, this is uh, Nerd Science here, and I am doing a new segment uh, called Quarantine Movies. Because while we are in quarantine, there's nothing better to do than watch TV or watch movies. Uh, by better, I mean nothing else really to do. Um, so I've decided to start watching movies that I have uh, otherwise missed or not seen before for whatever reason. Maybe life quits in the way. Maybe I wanted to see it in theaters. Maybe I never heard about it. And this is now a perfect time to uh, revisit those movies that I had not seen before. Uh, today's uh, the very first movie that we'll be doing on this um, new special is uh, 2019's Miss Bala. Uh, Miss Bala is a uh, action thriller. It's described as an action thriller uh, directed by Catherine Hardwick. Catherine Hardwick directed, uh, for those of you who don't know, she was the director of the original Twilight movie. Uh, so, kind of goes to show you where this review is going to go. Uh, yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and review the movies. Uh, it's, um, how do you call it? Uh, Miss Bala it stars uh, Gina Rodriguez uh, and a bunch of other people you've never heard before. And also, Anthony Mackie makes an appearance in the movie. Anthony Mackie, of course, is of Avenger fame uh, and of 8 Mile fame, where he lost so bad in 8 Mile that he decided to become an Avenger. That's how bad Eminem beat him in 8 Mile. Uh, but uh, he makes an appearance in uh, Miss Bala, which uh, is the Spanish meaning, the English translation of Miss Bala is Miss Bullet. And it's a film about a uh, Mexican-American woman uh, who goes to visit a friend uh, down in Mexico uh, to, because she wants to be, her friend wants to be in a uh, beauty pageant. And uh, Gina Rodriguez is a makeup artist. So something happens, uh, shit hits the fan. And uh, uh, by some twists and turns of some uh, events, uh, she gets caught up in a situation where she's between a drug dealer. Uh, she gets kidnapped by a drug dealer. And now there's some shenanigans going on and her life is at risk and in danger. And what would otherwise be a decent movie uh, the writers of this movie, um, have decided, uh, to give us the shittiest ending to an action thriller that you could pretty much, uh, come up with. It's, uh, it's a shit ending. Therefore, uh, I give this movie, uh, four poops, four poops. It's four poops. Yeah, look, look at that. Four poops. Uh, because that's, yeah, four out of five poops. Uh, the ending itself is that bad. It It's just the rest of the movie is meh. It's like, okay, nothing bad, nothing great, nothing out of this ordinary, nothing out of this world, but also not awful. And then the last 10, 15 minutes and just goes to, to poop. It goes to shit four times. It goes to poop four times. So that's my rating for this movie. Uh, hope you guys are, are dealing well with the quarantine. Make sure you stay home. Watch some movies. If you have any recommendations for movies, make sure to hit me up uh, and listen to my podcast available at geekbro.net, uh, Mount Geekmore, and the What's Up Bro podcast. Make sure you tune in on iTunes and everywhere podcasts uh, can be found. Bye.